Hello everyone and welcome to a smash look at Warshift. Frat here as always and this comes from, I really hope I say this right, Cyril Medjum. Really hope I said that right. What is Warshift? Well, it is an action RTS. Basically, you can play an FPS sort of type mode where you're controlling a one troop. You have like a hero unit or you can play in RTS mode. And to be honest, it's fantastic. Like I have been properly enjoying myself. There's, I would like to bring your attention to it. it is a early access title, so things can be, you know, it says there warning it is early access. Some stuff is in development, some stuff are experimental, seeing what works, what doesn't, and some stuff might run into some bugs. For the most part, it works pretty darn well. Anyway, first up, settings menu. You've got high, medium, low. You can set the gameplay difficulty. I have this at normal. Believe me, some of you are probably going to, like, I've almost been tempted to knock it down to the, the lower level of the uh, below normal because it's ridiculous hard the enemy can win by gathering so many resources or overwhelming you it's just it's rather insane because uh, some of the levels it it just is non-stop it really keeps you on your toes and you see in the background some stuff going on here the game involves space fights you can be in you know space battles or you're controlling one ship and moving in massive dreadnoughts to help you out you can be on the ground with multiple troops going on and you it's almost like a mobile battles going on because you're constantly sending troops down while defending different areas or you can be on a big massive map or you can be in the air it's like land sea and air at well space it's insane the amount of stuff you can do in this and of course there's campaign skirmish multiplayer it is a ton of fun but yes um these are gameplay settings, audio settings I would like to break down a little bit. Uh, I'd like it to be at least two, like audio settings and possibly um, dialogue. Because the dialogue feels it's a little bit quiet compared to what I would like it to be. Anyway, let's uh, get into the campaign. I'm going to show you some stuff so you can see some, some things. There is some tutorials here. If I go into this, uh, I'll bring up this. It is actual tutorials are all uh, on the Warshift. Uh, actual YouTube page where it will it gives you video pr presentations and it's pretty darn good to be honest. I would like to see it incorporated into the game, but it's fast. It gets there. It's quick. It's done. I mean, some people who might want to play this offline might run into issues with that. And that's about the only thing I can see. But apart from that, we'll just get back to this. And okay, so campaign. Shall we get started, folks? And also the music. It's awesome. I mean, one of the only things uh, any my uh, bugbears because obviously is early access some things will be improved and stuff is sometimes the audio doesn't match up when you hit like uh, this is the very first battle you're in anything that's got stars what you completed as you see i've only completed a few you can try any map you want any level you want just be warned it's not going to be easy i have failed so many missions it's insane but yes, you can actually click here and you'll get a wee description of what's going on, your objectives of the game, then come and message and you can view the video briefing. Now sometimes I have noticed the audio doesn't quite match up with the text. The text goes a little bit quicker, it's about a good second's worth quicker. So it ends up, the, the video finishes before you actually get the audio to finish the sentence. So that all that needs is, I, I would assume, is a little bit of a tweak. But really, because we'll just play this, I'll, I'll hush up so you guys can listen to this. the energy weapons of Plag Eta to destroy the enemy bar. Use the long-range homing missiles against the enemy's interceptors. Warning, do not dive into the asteroid field. Collisions can destroy you. See, that's what I mean there is it does actually seem to go a little bit faster than the actual audio itself and the footage. That can be tweaked, but that's really my only bugbear about the game because there is so much variety in this game. So much fun. It's so good, and I cannot wait to see when this finally releases. Um, like as I do before, sometimes I, when early access titles come out, I do a, like a, another sort of smash look, you know, a release version as I've done um, with Gear Up Alpha, uh, or Gear Up, should I say. Um, but let's uh, dive in here. I'll just... Oh, I need to... I, I know... Sometimes, yes, you have to repeatedly click this. This is probably my only other thing. You have to repeatedly click this to actually 
be able to start the mission. And it's just like click, click, right, okay, could I start, please, no, okay, right. Fair enough. That also reminds me of Fallout. Just putting that out there. But the art style is like, the, the actual models of everything look incredible. The art style is incredible. The actual quality is incredible. The game just, there's so much variety because you're upgrading your own hero unit. You're, you know, controlling your other units, making sure they get into the battle and you're controlling other abilities of each unit. Your, um, your arc allows to be able to attack with special abilities. Um, there's just so much as you can see here, the video that I'm showing you off is, you do have your guardian unit that you play. Well, then you get other units that you can summon and build with your resources and everything. Um, obviously this is a space battle. So there'll be... Is that going to let me play this time? Yeah, there we go. So there is a lot in it. Um, I'll show you this one, but then obviously I'm going to quickly show you uh, the next one. So I want to add a bit of extra attack. I want to have some extra missiles. So you got a bunch of weapon systems you can add on. And it actually adds it on. Like physically you see the, that... Oh, hi guys. You, you're just having fun back there. Um, I'm going to get uh, some more armor. No, that's installed. Advanced aiming. Yeah, we'll go advanced aiming. And it actually adds bits on, which is really kind of cool. Like, seriously. Up here, you've got your certain resources and your experience points. Obviously, this is your health bar, and this is your actual bar for using your abilities. So anytime you use any of these, it's going to start to run down. Let's deploy. Now we go, and away we go. So shift is it. So spacebar allows you shift and spacebar kind of do the same thing we've got units coming out of this we've got units coming out of this and then of course to go to rts mode hit tab and there we go we're in rts mode and we've got a couple of dreadnoughts here i would list you to head up there i want you to aim into artillery mode start firing oh dear um so we need to drop ship to get to the like, we need to get through there right i can bring the arc forward a bit so like if i die um all these units where is the enemy base Head for the enemy base. We're just going to go for the enemy base. Oh, that's good. Um, this actually has orbital strikes, so you can actually do this. Uh, you need to be certain level sometimes during a mission to actually be able to summon these. But you are able to build these. So I'm going to build some fighters. And where's my unit? Let's go. Go. Now, the only thing is, is some of the, the sounds of guns I'd like to be kind of changed a little bit. Because uh, this seems a bit too pew pew, but let me sit for some rockets. Have some rockets at you. Obviously, some sounds were probably missing. Because please give, bear in mind that is early access for you. Come on. But you're you're going to need to get in about it, like in about the the actual units and try. Oh, I'm right out of reload. Uh, come on, kill, 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 kill. There we go. But you're going to actually have to get in about, like, in the fight. But then you're also going to need to make sure your units around you are still fighting. And I've actually got upgrades, so you can actually return to the Ark if you want, or wait till you're destroyed. Yeah. You get out of here. And where, where's the... We're almost there. Come on. And you get you down, and get you down. Leave him alone. Get him out there. Yes. Come on! Ah! Get out of here! You out of here too! Get out of here! There we go. Now the way we have to destroy this is we have to destroy the enemy's art by using our dreadnoughts. I'm gonna head back to my base. Gonna use uh, some quick abilities there. Because I mean, we mean we have all this going on. We have some drop ships that we need to actually get through. But I have two dreadnoughts. We may as well use them. And we've got a bunch of units here. Just gonna head into here, enter the arc. Thank you very much. Uh, like some more attack, please. Um, can I get some more abilities? Could I have that? Yes, I can. <laughs> it's always better. And fast repair, deploy. Let's get up. What have we got? How many units have we got? How many units have we got? You need to build me some more units. Nope. There. Order five. Give me five of them. Give me five. Right, guys. Um, go for it. Uh, artillery mode on that. Where is the other dreadnought? Um, you attack that. Right, where are you? Let's go. Oh, nice. Come on, we can do this. Goodbye. Oh, 
it just becomes so freaking cool to actually play this. Goodbye. You're not getting past me either. Nope, 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 nope. Get out of here. And reload, reload, reload. Enemy Zark is right here. Can we take it down? Oh, you have turrets. These are turrets. Ow, ow. Okay, okay, okay. I'm, I'm leaving. We have some units got all coming up. Get you down. The music does play in the background. Some of the music is rather fantastic. Uh, let's get these guys. Come on. We have units in here. There we go. You over here. I'm not going to be able to get in there, am I? Ah! Pull back! Ah, uh, units keep get They do feel like units are a bit flimsy, but it's the same for the enemy as well. Like, you're the one that's kind of the, the main thing. Even your dreadnoughts can feel a bit flimsy, and then I died. Now, the only way you kind of perish is if... Alright, folks, there might be a slight cut there because Fraps decided to crash on me, but I managed to get it to behave again. Uh, we're just going to hit respawn and first choose improvement. Uh, recovery. That should give us a bit more, and can I have them? Yes, I can. I didn't want to stall them. Ah, god dang it. Can I stall them there? Or can I switch them around? Okay. And get additional um, proof cooling. That'll do nicely. And then we're going to have neutron collider. We'll have that. Oh, are we getting attacked? Is there, they aren't getting attacked there. Let's get out of here. Let's go. You just get away from there. Get away, get away, get away, get away. I wonder what this one's like. No targets detected. Right. What if I do this? Hi. Hello. Um. Get out of here. What, if I do? what does this one do? Oh. Hi. Like. Oh. What? Uh, okay. Nice. Ah, right, go, go away. Right. I'll leave him because it, it will be AI controlled. We do need to be able to try and get this in though. Can I bring them into bombarding mode? Like that. Ah! Hi. Now you do that and build me a ton of them. Give me a ton of them. But you, I need you to bombard that. And where's the other one? We had two. Bombard that. Where is my unit? He's getting it. Beaten up. I'm trying to get rid of some of these. Because that means our units could get through a bit easier. But these guys are not being very nice. Have at thee. Oh. That's one down. Okay, that's one down. Um, and just quite a few of you guys here. Okay. You do not like me. I'm out of here. My dreadnoughts are coming to bear, so you have a tough time now fighting this. I can take you down and take you down. Let's get rid of you and get rid of you. The dreadnoughts are right here. Come on. Oh, there we go. Fire the missiles. Fire everything. Oh. oh damn. That was quite the hit there, but we need some more units. We do need some more units. Uh, where's the rest of our units? Where's the rest of our units? As you can see, it's pretty darn frantic. You guys get up here and get up here. Just get up here and help. Get up here and help. Come on. Up here and help. Are they doing? They've done quite a bit of damage. Oh wait, I got taken out. Oh well. So it actually does tell you, you know, your avatar has been damaged, but um, we're about to respawn now. Armor. Deploy. I'm just going to get rid of that just now. Get rid of that. Right. Order is complete. Go. Basically, the game looks fantastic. We're already at this and you see already what's going on. Um, you can get out of here.
There we go. If we can get rid of this, that'd be nice. Ah, there's another one down. And goodbye. Goodbye. Nice. So these guys are... Ah, so mental. And I just love what this game can actually lead to. You're dead as well. Get out of here. I mean, this is one of the games I potentially would be like, I want to do a full play review on this because it's that freaking cool. Ah, come on. I'm going to head back here. Have we got any more units? Do I have any more units? And make sure that that's actually bomb... Ah, that's it. Artillery mode. Bombard that. Artillery mode. Bombard that. Where's the other units that we had built? Right, you guys get over here. This one's there. Get over here. One's here. Over here. Just gonna build this some more units. Build some structures. No, we want units. Get as many of them as we can grab a hold of. Uh, I'm gonna bring the arc slightly up a wee bit more. Because these are keeping that there. Oh, they're right in there. Ah, my avatar's taken out. We're gonna lose these though at this time. Launch any aircraft you have. Launch any aircraft you have. That is almost dead though. Yes! Done! You're getting this wee victory screen, nice wee model comes up there. And you press any key to continue. But I would really to just take one other mission before I round off this video. Obviously it's going to be slightly longer. But I want to, is it this one I want to play? Capture free flying eyes and you, no. Basically in this one you actually, if I click the video briefing, you'll see that we actually start as you actually take on a foot soldier. So there's different things, a foot soldier, there is your big mech, your flying mech as well. So there's just so much variety. I'm just going to cancel this mission because I want to go into... I think it's Cyborg's Uprising, isn't it? No. There's one that I want to capture the coast and destroy enemy towers. This one is rather good. It's just uh, quite... Uh, can I create a powerful army to capture a volcanic island and destroy the enemy arc? I'm going to go with this one. I'm going to go with deep diving and see how we get on for you guys. So I'll let the mission play over so you guys can see there are so many creatures, just the, the, the way the race looks compared to yours, it's insane. There's also big creatures just flying about just casually. I like how there's just so much, like you feel the world is alive. So yeah, let's get this started. Is that going to let me start? That That is one thing, like, it just seems like that little bit just needs tweaked that allows you to just start the mission if you want. Come on, let me go, let me go, let me go. No, let me go. But you can already see how much is actually in the game, like, looks, feels, plays. It's so good. But now I'm going to show you some of the land warfare, which should be pretty freaking fun to play. All right, come on, game. Let me in. You're not going to let me in, are you? Please bear in mind, though, you can actually find the link down below to the early access page on Steam. That's all that's there. For any Smash Licks we do. Um, in case you were wondering, like, oh, I'm going to go get it already. I would love to play some multiplayer with some folks on this. There we go. So we have the Corsair, and it's a heavy battle unit, and we want to put up attack. What have we got? A machine gun and some bullets. Uh, I, want to, I want to put on that. I can't put on that. And that's installed. Okay. Can we have an extra armor, though? I have some extra armor. That'd be lovely. Let's deploy. And we have this. Da-da-da. And you can fly if you want. Or you can come down. So yeah, you've got all this you can do. And then, of course, here's your base. 
Now, all your units are supplied by this guy, so if you want units that are just there to... Ah, I can only build... I can build these. Give me two of them. Now, this has to build units. It has to build buildings. Everything comes from this. I'm going to cancel one of them. So, keep that in mind when building units. And all units' uh, buildings have to be powered by this. It usually has three to four nodes that can actually be built from. And your... Any unit that passes something will be the ones that will actually activate this. Oh, land then. Dafty. Hello. Would you like to die? Oh. That's just like a big cannon, I dig it. Oh, fair enough. Right. I'd say I'm going to switch back to... T you stay there. Um, you're out now, so you're going to come to the front. And I want to... I want to build some defensive towers, trust me. They're really, really good. And we had some units going up there, didn't we? They're fighting that. Oh, they're doing pretty well, actually. Where is the actual enemy's arc? Over there. Where are these guys going to? They're heading to the volcano, right? Ah, they're going to go get that. And what I want to do is try and get over here to get a bit more resources. Because there is a good couple of piles here that we can actually get. That's around here. And there's that. So if I go this way, I can actually maybe grab this. Actually, yes. We'll grab that. Let's go over there. Build this right there. Then I'm going to get the drilling platform going. And that'll be us. And then, Because the more resources we have coming in at any time, the more better. Uh, these guys are not doing anything anymore. Crap. Order is completed. Good. Um, if I had them going this way, go for the enemy base, rather than anything else. Go for the enemy, I can just select to make automatic production of anyone I want. I want three of them at any given time going. It will take off 1200 resources every 60 seconds, but we are getting some of this built. Where is my unit? He's over there. Oh dear. No, 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 no. Nope. Be gone with you. Be gone with you. Be gone with you. Be gone with you. Hey, right, get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Haha. -ha. You're gonna send more, aren't you? You're sending way more, aren't you? Get out of here. Ha. Now I'm gonna build this to stop you getting down here. These things are so powerful, but I mean, don't allow them to get overwhelmed. You can see, oh, really? Hi. Some of the music is fantastic. Uh, we have some fights going on here. Guys come to the front. I just love, the game works so seamlessly. There is no hiccuping. Um, that can go there. Get some drilling going. Get that going. So this will be the defensive line. And this is going to be where the units are flowing out into. Oh, no, 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 no. Get over there. Go. There's one of these big guys. The volcano is a pain to actually kill. Ha ha! Look at the size of this thing! Get out of here! Down! Right, where is my... You... Get over here. Right, you need to build that right there. I don't know if that can actually take any more nodes, but you can actually build more. And also a docking platform which allows you to build battleships. I need to be level 4 for that. Dang it. Let's get out there. I think we're going to need some more of these at the front. Um, some of our units are just perishing as they get around there. Um, these guys are coming down there. This is okay over here. Oh, great. There's a volcano coming this way. Will this be able to power this? I'm not entirely sure. All nodes are at... Dang it. Oh well. This could do with an extra. They do have quite a range on them, which is always really good. Um, that volcano is dead. Good, good, good. I'm just going to get down here and fight with them. Get out of here. Can I hit this from here? I can't actually hit that from here. I'm going to need to create some units to actually go with that, aren't I? Hmm. There is one thing. Obviously, units come out and are doing it automatically. 
go round. But you can actually just take the units it gives you and put them somewhere else. I want this to create another vehicle depot. There's three units going that way, but I want to take them this way because I want to be able to push down this way to try and capture this point. Because if we can choke hold that area, that'll be very, very good. So yeah, I'm going to bring these units down here. Ah, they'll be fine. How many units is this making? How about we up that to four? So you have enough resources coming in. Um, that There doesn't seem to be any function to repair unless I'm just not noticing it, which is probably true. Um, if I put this here... Then build... Build vehicles. Oh, we have quite a few units coming in there. I'm gonna get another bunch of guys coming out though. Get lost. Right, these guys... Push! Go! And you can get down and fight with them! It's so cool! Right, let's uh, push up, go for them. Kill them. Nice. Now the only thing is, is there doesn't seem to be any sound effects when sort of explosion going on in this bit, which seems a bit odd. Let's go get that tower. I'm gonna just take off. Why the hell not? You cannot touch me! I'm gonna get taken out. And I'm gonna lose that avatar, aren't I? Nope, he's... No, no. Oh, they're distracted by the volcano. Never mind. Ow, hush. <laughs> yeah, let's get this going and put that... Let's turn to spawn. Done. Let's get another one of them and we can respawn. I think we're a few levels up though, so we can get some armor. And I'm going to get some new weapons. Ooh. Cluster bomb. That will do nicely. Do we give me energy recycling system or automatic repair system? Sounds like a good idea to have. And let's go. Okay, so we've got enough units coming out here. These guys are all here. So how about we grab all this and go this way? Oh, they've broken through that actually. Right, you do not we, you go that way, you go that way, you go that way. Quickly. That'll be fine. That's the enemy is starting to up the ante quite a bit, though. They're having a lot of bloody units. Get the volcano dead. Yes, nice one. Now we're gonna push to that. Just do it. Uh, that is this guy. Order one of them. Get up here. Immediately stop the activity while he's flying and he's probably gonna die. <laughs> Never mind. Um, can we get another one on that node, I'm wondering. These guys, there's a lot pumping down that side, so... I'm gonna set these guys at the front and respawn, thank you. Can I get the next... No, I can't. Fine. Advanced targeting, not enough money. Okay, deploy. I'm just going to quickly come out there and see how these guys are doing. Not very good. Not very good at all. All nodes are in. Ah, dang it. Right, so we need units to go that way. These guys are about to pump out some units, though, so I'm going to just take them all. Can I have them? Can I have them? Let's go! Go for it! Right, that's up and running and get this going. Go units! Come on! Wait, did I take down another one already? Really? I suppose they are bringing volcanoes out quite often, that's the only thing. Ah, that'll be fine, that base bit. Just take a lot of units down here, go say hi, there's another good thing, volcano. 
Everybody attack the volcano. Go for it, go for it. Because if we can choke hold this point, that will stop them a lot. And then we can take these out because that will reduce the amount of units coming this way. Where are these units coming from, actually? Are they just coming from the top of the mountain? Just randomly from the top of the mountain? All nodes are already in use. Can I build this back at the base then? Nope. Get in there! Get in there! Get up! Ow! Okay, never mind. That hurt. I'll focus on that. I'll focus on that. Get rid of it, get rid of it. Come on. And now get that. Yeah, controls, I probably haven't mentioned it a bit because I've been overly excited about this, but it is really quite easy to actually use. Quite simple enough. Um, let's get rid of that. Everybody attack it. Respawn. Um, can I get any of the... Yes, I can get not enough money. Okay, deploy. You. Go over there. Yes. Kill it. Come on, you guys can take it down. Where's our base? Base is this way. Nope, it's not. It's this way. I'm gonna nab a few of you guys to bring this way, please. Don't go that way. I'm just gonna switch back to him so I can actually make him fly. Go. Cool. Hello. I hear you like cannons. Have some cannons. Let's get a drilling platform going in this. Nice. We can actually take the Ark and place it there if we so wish to. But hey. Um, am I able to kill these guys yet? I've hounded them into the corner. Ah, the volcano is making me... No. I don't know why that does that. It seems to be a wee bit of hitch there, but... We could actually build loads of more stuff here if we wanted to. This I think is actually in the way, unless these guys are just being a pain. Yep, these guys are just being a pain. But we do have this that we can now use. So place that there and get another, another salt. Get up here. Because if we can put this in, we can actually then hopefully build a few more power nodes because then we could put units to then go this way which will just cause them a headache and put that there no oh, go that way wrong surface now, don't tell me it's the wrong surface just work I need to be level 5 to build them dang fine well, I want to I need to be level 4 fine I'm gonna go kill stuff Why am I not hitting you? Have some missiles instead. I'm level... What am I level now? I... You can see that from so far away. It's insane. Uh, little guy, you're in my way. Nope. Get rid of the volcano. Nice. Ow. Hi. You hurt. A lot. Run over here. Um, what else we got? What else we got? Right, these guys are okay there. They're okay there. Are they doing okay? Yep. That just sent a new wave down that way. So if I was to select this, can I double click? No. Which way is these? Why is that sending them that way still? No. Go to there. They keep trying to go up the mountain. Stop trying to go up the mountain and kill them. We do have a lot of units we can actually use. But I need more power nodes and we're still not at the right level. But I think we should be at the right level for this. Yes. So I was to bring my unit back to here because there is a power node we can use over there. Let's 
get rid of them. Take a bit more active role and just try to get these units up there. May actually be able to push. I want to see this because this would be pretty cool to actually show you guys. Oh dear. Well, this is rather big. The energy source is not activated. Come on you, back here. These are about to pump out more units to then go down there and fight. Yes, nice. Let's get these guys as well. And that guy. Wait, is that area still okay over there? Uh, it's reasonably okay. Probably need to send more units down there though. Right, now that that's here, we can build this. I have a, a dreadnought, because why the hell not? I think you can only build one per game, though. That's the only thing. Right, go, guys. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Why is it not moving? Move. Move. Um, this. Ah. There we go. Let's go. Now, it does need to come back and actually make some more stuff, but you can actually have only one per game. So, sadly, but oh well. We have a lot of units. We could push so much down this way. Um, and they're doing okay up there. Have I got enough? Nope, not level up yet. <laughs> they don't stand a chance. It's like, Hi, goodbye. Let's go. We should be able to push this pretty darn hard now. Let's uh, go. Let's get you up. Go. And I uh, just nudged my. Yeah, Fraps doesn't like this at all. Um, it, but it might be due to me having two monitors, sadly. Um, let's just bunch out of that. You. If we can then actually, actually, if we attack that, we can then smack into that. There we go. There we go. All the rockets. Uh, they do, yes, they do have an ammo consumption, so that's got to be kept in track while you're building some stuff. Let's go get you. And pop. Let's get that next. Go for it. We have more units coming round now as well. Very, very nice. Very nice. And um, what I'd probably like to do is... Do we have units going that way? Yes. It's okay. Let's get another vehicle department going. That's out of rockets now. Hmm. Let's... Uh, do you have an aircraft? Oh dear, hi. No, don't kill me. Don't kill me. Can I now build? Um, and the resource is not captured, but what if I put it there? Get you guys round to here so we can continue to push. Where is he? Love how you just see things of the of like the dreadnoughts. Just like, oh, I'm just sitting down, you know, chilling. Uh, get inside the ark. Enter the ark. I wish more attack speed, please. And them. Nope. Them. Yes, them. Thank you. Fast repair. Thank you. we go and I'm gonna plunk myself down here no nope, actually I'm gonna plunk myself down here like because that should mean that we can power this up 
which will then mean we can then be a douche and put these right here. Which way are they going? They're going straight that way, but we wanted to go that way. We're almost pushing through, which is very, very fantastic. Um, if I get that to go over there as well, we can then get that. How's the dreadnought? Refilled? Good. Take off and get over here. Yep. Get over here. Please. Thank you. How many units are going down that way? One, two. Got to keep that. Gotta keep them in tools. We're attacking in all directions. It's fantastic. Um, I'm gonna build this here. There we go. And then we're gonna put uh, another cyborg base. Oh wait, I don't want another cyborg base actually. Cancel that. I need a vehicle base here. You guys are gonna just go along. It basically gets to the point that you can just run units up and it's going to be pretty f insane. Let's get them to there. Dreadnought, fire on that. This is that done. If we change that to that way. Put them into there. Go. All the units. More units going around that way. Annoying them that direction. The volcano's like crap. Where'd I go? I mean, we have this point here that we could also build some turrets to stop these guys coming down here. Maybe. I hope it works. We'll soon find out. Let's try that. I know this has been a fairly long video, so thank you very much. There is a lot to take in about Warship, but hopefully we can end this on a high and actually take this out. Would that actually stretch that far? Distance between. There we go. Right, that's that powered up. So let's go round to here then. Is my dreadnought still fighting? Yes. And it's out of bullets though. I'm gonna send it back to get some healed. Let's get it sent back now. Go 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 dreadnought! Don't die. But that's that powered up. So what have we done? Hmm. Yeah, probably best to put two turrets down here just to kind of stop these. I don't know where they're actually coming from. Are they just going through there, I think? They must be. I don't like, like the sort of slight popping of notice to end units when you go away and it's like, hmm. I'd like, I don't know if that's maybe a graphical setting somewhere. Um, let's get this. We can actually put this here. Put that there. Then we can put another drilling platform and make more money come in. We've got a huge amount of units about to walk around though. Let's get this built. Uh, build that, thank you. And we're going to build another vehicle depot because why the hell not? There doesn't seem to be any customization of vehicles. Um, that can be a win or lose for people. To There's so many different things. And hello, you're going to come down here, aren't you? So, yeah, the game is slightly mobile with a more interactive thing in a way, some people. But I can see, like, there's some RTS elements, there's action elements, there's this. Which is just awesome. Right, you guys, attack that. Get, just go. Attack that bloody thing. Get it out of here. Go. So we have a spawn point here now, which I'm going to set this to go this way. Uh, get rid of that. Get rid of that, if you can. Everybody attack. Can I actually... I could build this, actually. Mm. No. What I want to try and do is get some of these, though, because it would be nice to actually get some more points up there. That's coming across. These units are coming in. Get up there. Go. Where's my unit? Where's my Corsair? Where, where actually is he? Get over here. Ah, dang it. Fine. 
Get him. We have more than enough units going up there. Let's get some rid of some of the air. Be nice. Get rid of some of that. There we go. That's so gonna. Please. There we go. Take it down. Another bloody volcano. Where can I put this? Can you put it anywhere? Like just anywhere? Can I put it on the beach? Should position on a flat surface near active energy source. Oh, okay. So it needs to be somewhat near this. Hmm. So what if I put it here? Nope. Does it have to be a node itself then? Ah, okay. But I could then build that along. I like where this is going. Let's get that. Get the volcano. I just realized I didn't respawn my own character. There's so much going on. Uh, that is installed. That requires level 6. What can we get to add in here though? Cancel that. Thank you. Uh, ooh, that one. Just because. And I'm going to just bring my own... There's lots of units here. Lots of units here. Get around here. We could use some help. Did I lose my dreadnought? Oh dear. I lost the dreadnought. Crap. Can I have another one please? Make another one please. I'm just wondering if this works. But the, the source isn't captured. Dang it. Fine. I'm hoping this works. I don't know. I think you actually need your commander somewhere to actually activate a power source. Why are you going up that way? Don't go up that way. Get around here. Get rid of that volcano. That would be lovely. Let's get rid of these guys now. So that volcano comes out of them. Hmm. That actually produces units. So if we can take that out, that will stop them producing so many units for a little bit. Yes, we're going to overwhelm them now. So let's uh, pile the units in there. Pile the units in there. Just get in. We have a lot. That's an incredible amount of units just going down the side. All the explosions. Actually, you know what? Let's go. Cool. Have at thee. Is that one down? There we go. And let's take down the enemy arc. Everybody attack. There we go. This is totally going to end on a nice wee high for the level. How many, how much can I produce them? Let's produce them ridiculously fast. Yes, there we go. Anyway guys, I know this has been a pretty darn long episode of a smash look at this, but Warshift deserves it. It's awesome. The link is down below, uh, as co of course, if you wish to check it out. Please do. Um, there's a lot to it. There's a lot to dive into. And I shall see you guys in the next one.